Alright ladies and gents, we are back literally mere minutes from our departure to the Centaur's part of the system. It's going to be exciting. Now I'm not sure how I'm going to go about doing this for the simple fact I'm not used to having this kind of fuel with me. Um, are we set to go? Is this facing the right way? Are we facing the right way? That, sh that should not be the periapsis there. In fact what I should be doing is I should be going towards the prograde. I need to like double check this calculation just to make sure that everything is going to according to plan. So let's go ahead and go to this part here. And yes, in 15 minutes. Yeah, we are going to be facing progress by the time this comes around. I'm going to go ahead and get to five minutes. All right, this should do because the nervous will take a few minutes longer, but this will give us a hell of a lot of boost. So I'm going to go ahead and thrust up and I'm going to begin this part of the process. Do this a minute early. And this should give us a little bit of power for the power that we've been using as we've been doing this. Interesting, interesting indeed. Use that fuel. Use all of the fuel. And power us on to Centaur. You see, this isn't just the hard, uh, this part now either. We've then got to go ahead and do the correction burn, which is then going to use up another 2,600 Delta Vs, which isn't cool. It should be about that, unless I've done this burn completely wrong and then it's going to go completely tits up. Right, this uh, has run out. Let's go ahead and kill that. We're going to reduce them and we're going to do it then. Go ahead and push them all the way up and enjoy as much of the uh, non overheated engines as we can. So we've got three minutes for the six talent. I have re fucked myself on the calculation. Never mind. We've still got plenty of time. All the time in the world. Let's uh, get some time off on. Uh, we're going to thrust out. Uh, keep the thrust out and stop us from overheating. But that was certainly a big boost towards hitting our goal of where we need to be. Definitely. And it will help us out in the long run. Uh, possibly circularising ourselves around the, the planet Centaur. How we might even be able to get to orbit around a lesser planet and then we got even really that plus Centaur. Or we could just float around in itself. Who knows? Who knows the name? It could be pronounced Centaur. I'm just going to call it Centaur, but who knows? I like Centaur. Centaur sounds like a bit more on this map. And once we're done, I think uh, we should be able to begin our operation. So I'm just going to slow down a little bit here because the maneuver node is going a bit haywire, so that's always good to know. That means we're coming to the end of our bay. Third of our fuel. That's pretty good. Last time I did this, I used about half, so that's not bad at all. We've definitely saved any fuel using that stage there. So we can now, this shouldn't be too far off being what it was. So, yeah, that looks about right to me. So the next part is going to be adding a manoeuvre to the manoeuvre planner. We're going to go ahead and we're going to create a node. Yeah, that looks good. 1,820. Yeah, that's nice. So we can go ahead and close that. Close this down. For those of you who still think I'm cheating, screw you guys. This is actually how NASA would do it themselves. But to get to this, we're looking at 172 days. 172 days? A fucking scandalous, man. Right, okay, so get to the node. Let's begin some warp away from here. Bye bye, Kerbin. Oh, Kerbin's already gone. Screw that noise. <laughs> Kerbin didn't give a shit. <laughs> Kerbin's already gone, man. Kerbin's long gone at this point. Let's go ahead and. Can I time warp any faster? I'm noticing that I'm getting an extra two arrows here that don't seem to be doing anything, but I, I don't I don't know. I, 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 I see, see I don't understand what just happened there. Whoa. Is there an extra time warp feature? I don't I don't know how it's working, but never mind. We're, we're getting there really fast. Uh, three days. Uh, that looks pretty good. How are we doing on the power situation? Power seems to be going quite nicely. Are we facing the sun? More or less, the panels are getting as much power as they can get, so that's always good. Let's go ahead and speed this up until we get to uh, the three minutes, three seconds. Whoa, about six hours. Keep going down. 
down. I suppose this can be a bit off. I suppose it really doesn't matter. So let's go down. Three, two, one. Uh, okay, so that wasn't good. I'm now at three plus three. Use all the burn until the overheat, and then we'll thrust down until to stop the overheating system. Um, this shouldn't be too bad in all fairness. We should be able to do this quite easily, I think. I hope, he says. Uh, let's go and thrust down. Good news, there we go. So we can now keep this on. So let's go ahead and do some time warp to help us out a little bit. And as you can see, we are starting to move our plane up to the planet in question. So, not a lot of effort has been done into getting here. It's just building a rocket big enough to do such things. And this could be used as a career, career mode rocket because I've included all the science modules to go along with it. Uh, the, the only cheaty thing is, is that I've used MechJet. But if you can get the phase angle down and remember what I've just done, then you could probably get there again. But who knows how long this thing even takes to orbit the sun. It's so far out, it probably takes fucking forever. It really does. Right, I'm going to start to slow down. Whoa, whoa. You know, I'm going to start to slow down. Yeah. I'm going to get on target and we're going to get this down. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to delete the node. So now we're working off ourselves here. 100 million. Let's thrust all the way up. Let's go for this. Right, 90 million. 33. I, I, I suppose that's good enough to tell you the truth. Uh, I'm more than happy with that. Can I make, perhaps maybe get it down? Not if I go that way. Perhaps if I go up. Now nah, I'm happy with that. So let's go ahead and warp. Let's see if we can do that crazy fast warp that I did before. Yeah, crazy fast warp. Check that out. I don't know when they added that, man, but... Yeah, I didn't even realise that was a thing now. There's been a lot to the game that I haven't seen or played because I just haven't had the time. University has been keeping me mega busy. Alright, okay, so let's go ahead and start making this closer. So while we've got the and the fuel to do such things, I need a closer look at this line so I can start maybe plotting a maneuver node if you're going to help me out a little bit, maybe. Plot maneuver, plot maneuver. Oh god damn it. Right, okay, we're gonna get a little bit closer in first, I think. Before we start doing any major any major issues here. How, how much fuel have we got exactly? Can I circularize from there? I don't think it's a bad attitude. I don't think it's a bad attitude at all. You see, you are we are within all uh you know all the planets that are circling. Hell, we're even almost on plane with uh, that Juno-like planet. That's pretty good, that is. I like that. I like that a lot. What What's it going to cost to... Oh, now it lets me set the maneuver. Now. What's it going to cost me to circularize right here? Add maneuver. This is going to be expensive. Ooh, nope, that's not correct. Um, it's not as expensive as I thought, so go back to here. Okay, so that that's not correct. So let's try this one again. Periapsis, go, go, have an Uber, go. Yeah, that looks good enough. We're in a nice little orbit there. So yeah, one thousand three hundred seventeen delta V's. One minute fifty. We've got this, ladies and gents. We've got this indeed. So where the hell is the marker? And let's get ourselves all nice and in. We should be quite close by now, to tell you the truth. So I'm going to go ahead and find the planets, wherever they are. It's going to take us three days to get there. Where, where are they all? <gasps> do, 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 do. There it is. It's right there. It's there for the taking. Oh, this is excellent. This is excellent, Snake. This is excellent indeed. Let's get a bit closer, a bit faster. Ooh. Oh, oh! Can you feel it? Can you feel the funk? Ten hours, nine hours, eight hours, seven hours. Ooh, I'm getting excited. We may actually even get a proper circularization on this, and not just a flyby like I originally thought I was going to achieve. Okay, so yeah, I'm good enough with this being here. So let's go. Turns out we are going to use all of our fuel in this, and then we'll jettison it, and it can carry on off into the cosmos for all I care. Yay for power. 
Yeah, check that. It looks really nice. I do like it. I really like it a lot. Right, can we see any of the other oddities? We've got the other ring. We've got Ringwell over there. We've got Erin, I believe it's called. The Waterlight Elu Planet. We've got Dune Light Planet over there. We've got it all going on here, ladies and gents. All going on indeed. All we need now is some time warp. And the job is good. Whew. It was a tough one getting here. Even with Metjev, I still had to build a rocket that would last, and I didn't expect to have something that would work as well as it did. It looks like we are reaching our point. We haven't even used all the nervous yet, so... Jobs are good. From here on out, this probe that we're going to jettison here will forever linger on in the Centaur system. S center system. Central system. Oh, who gives a fuck? It's, a, it's the ring planet system as far as I'm concerned. Oh well, ladies and gents. I hope you've enjoyed this. Maybe with this fuel that I've got left, I might actually chance go into another planet. But maybe perhaps in another episode, we'll come back to this and we'll have another look. As, as always, you can find the mods in the description of this video. Don't forget to hit like for the extra planets and all the, the crazy stuff that we've got about in the system. Oh, check it out, man. Circularized orbit around center. It's absolutely amazing. Modded planets, ladies and gentlemen. The future of Kerbal is here. I'll catch you all in a bit, people. Peace out.